Welcome to another mental health book review. And now it's time for a passage from Unfuck Your Brain by Dr. Faith Harper. Who is this book for? This book is for the people who ask, but why, all the time. The people who annoyed the crap out of the adults around them when they were little kids by asking questions about how the world worked so they could understand their place in it. Because the why is really needful information. This book is for all the people who hate being told what to do by other people who just want the tools and the information that they need to figure out what to do for themselves. You may be figuring this out by yourself or with a rock star therapist who knows better than to boss you around. Either way, you know you are in charge of your own fucking life when it comes down to it because you are sure as hell responsible for all the consequences. This book is for the people who are fucking tired of hearing or thinking that they are just crazy or stupid or lazy or too sensitive or or just need to get over themselves, who are tired of feeling bad, but even more tired of people thinking they enjoy feeling bad. Like anyone would choose misery. Like they think you are just refusing to get better. Like you want to be miserable. A fucking course you don't, but you've been stuck and with no idea why. So this book is about the why you are miserable so you can do something about it. What is up everybody? This is Chris from The Rewired Soul where we talk about the problem but focus on the solution. And yeah, I just finished reading this incredible book by Dr. Faith Harper, all right? And I wanted to start this video out by reading the introduction to it because so many of you were hooked in by this video because you can relate to everything it just said. And that's one of the reasons why I love this book so, so much. So Dr. Harper, she has this amazing ability of talking about mental health, but in a fun, very laid back and relatable way. Like she talks to you like you're a person. Like I know one of the things that I always hated was especially dealing with a doctor where it seems like they're kind of talking down to you. Like I'm the big fancy doctor and you need to listen to me because I know what I'm talking about. Like Dr. Faith Harper like brings herself down to your level and just talks to you like you're a person. And that's what, what's amazing about this book. But aside from that, she is smart as hell, okay? For those of you who don't know, one of the reasons why my channel is called The Rewired Soul is because I've always been fascinated about how the brain actually works and how we can actually rewire it to improve our mental health. And that's a lot of what this book is talking about. So this book is called Unfuck Your Brain, using science to get over anxiety, depression, anger, freakouts, and triggers. So in part one of this book, she talks about what's actually happening to your brain. She talks about where anxiety, where depression, where trauma actually stems from and what it actually does to your brain because then you go on this kind of journey to learn how to rewire your brain. So part one has these sections, okay? Part one, this is your brain on trauma. How your brain gets fucked, how trauma rewires the brain, unfuck your brain, getting better, retrain your brain, getting professional help, treatment options. So a lot of this stuff I knew already, but there were some things where like, because of the way Dr. Harper writes and talks, some things finally clicked and made sense. One of them being the default mode network, our brain's natural state of mind wandering and uh, storytelling. She put it in a way that really, really just made sense to me, even though I've read plenty of books on the neuroscience of how all this stuff works. So I love how she can do that. Like anybody can pick this book up and start to learn about what your brain's actually doing. From there though, she goes on and gives you a bunch of different treatment options like i've talked to dr harper a bit on instagram and like she is just like a wealth of knowledge she knows of so many different treatment options and that's what i love about her so much because something that i even try to do with my clients in my treatment center i try to give people a menu of options like okay here are all the different ways to get better i don't care which one you pick just pick one and she does a great job doing the same thing in this book so throughout this book she gives you a bunch of different exercises that you can do everything from mindfulness to actually sitting down and journaling some of your stuff but then she also talks about getting professional treatment options she talks about talk therapy she talks about allopathic meds naturopathic meds she goes on to acupressure and acupuncture. Like she will explain all these different options to you so you can look at them and say, oh, okay, that one sounds interesting. Okay, maybe that one will work for me. And then part two is this is your brain on life. And it's broken down into sections. Anxiety, anger, addiction, depression, and the importance of honoring grief. 
The importance of honoring grief was probably one of my favorite chapters in this book, especially because she talks about how grief is something like, not only is it the loss of somebody you know, but it could be the loss of a job, it could be loss of stuff, it could be loss of money, you know? It could be all sorts of different things. And she talks about how like, there's a process to dealing with all of these different forms of grief. But anyways, I had a mission to make this video as short and sweet as possible, because I don't wanna give you too much information because you need, you need to go out and get this book right now. And even if you don't think you need this book, buy a copy of this book, give it to somebody you know. And if you would like to get a copy of this book, there will be a link in the description below. And also, please share this video. Share with somebody who needs to have their brain un okay? But if you would like to learn more about Dr. Faith Harper, um, follow her on Instagram. She's very active on there. I will put her tag right here. It is at the intimacy doctor. All right, so go follow her on there. And we've been talking and hopefully sometime I can get her over here on the Rewired Soul so I can interview her and ask her some questions. So if you have any questions for her, make sure that you follow me on Instagram and Twitter at the Rewired Soul. So that way we have a, a wealth of questions to ask her when she comes on over. I'm actually actually thinking about buying a few copies and doing some kind of giveaway because I think this book is that important can help so, so many people. But anyways, if you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. And if you are new here, I'm always making videos to help you out with your mental and emotional well-being. Make sure you click that little round subscribe button. And if you wanna check out some more content on this channel, you can click or tap on one of those thumbnails right there, all right? So thanks again so much for watching. Go out and un your brain, and I'll see you next time.